Hi friends, I'm Pastor Joe. Today is Wednesday and I have your word for the day. Do you remember the sadness you felt the day your child was diagnosed with an incurable disease? Uh, do you remember the sadness you felt the day that your spouse died? Or, or maybe it was your best friend. Have you ever experienced hope dying? When I was a child in a child in psychi- uh, when I was a child in a psychiatric hospital, I had uh, weekly appointments with my mom. My bedroom in, in that hospital overlooked the parking lot, and the day of the appointment, I would wait at the window watching for my mom's little red Volkswagen to pull into the parking lot. I was eager. I was looking with anticipation. I was hopeful. I anticipated being released soon because my mom would show up for those meetings. But sadly, my mom missed most of those appointments. Most of the appointments that she was supposed to make to have with me, her son. And I remember that feeling of hope dying in my heart. I hated the feeling of disappointment. And so I stopped hoping. When Jesus died, I imagine the hope of the disciples died as well. They believed he was the chosen one. He was the Messiah who would save and restore Israel. In Mark chapter 15, verses 33 through 37, we read about the death of Jesus, the day hope died. Mark 15, beginning at verse 33. At noon, darkness fell across the whole land until three o'clock. Then at three o'clock, Jesus called out with a loud voice, my God, my God, Why have you abandoned me? Some of the bystanders misunderstood and thought he was calling for the prophet Elijah. One of them ran and filled a sponge with sour wine, holding it up to him on a reed stick so he could drink it. Wait, he said, let's see Elijah, whether Elijah comes to take him down. Then Jesus uttered another loud cry and breathed his last. Darkness had fallen over the whole land. Jesus was abandoned by God as Jesus, who knew no sin, became sin for you and I. Then he uttered a couple of cries with his dying breath and breathed his last. For many of his followers, this was the day that they would look back on and say, hope died when Jesus died. Some gave up, they huddled together, they stopped believing. Have you ever experienced anything that caused you to stop hoping in Jesus? If you have, please do not give up. Don't give up on hoping in Jesus. The moment you count him out may be the very moment he can show up, show off and change your life and restore hope to your heart. See, we have the luxury of looking back at this time of darkness and we know what happens three days later, but they did not. So hang in there, hold on, keep on calling out to Jesus because sooner or later, he will restore hope. If today's word for the day has blessed you, like it or leave a comment. God bless.